Hello, I'm Holly Collins, Coordinator of Parent and Family Engagement for the Fairfield Sassoon Unified School District. This is the first of a series of short videos that will provide helpful tips, resources, and tutorials designed to help our FSUSD families support their students during distance learning. Our first video today features Jen Rausch, Assistant Director of Curriculum and Instruction. Jen and her team are working on making sure our students have devices, textbooks, and materials to start the school year. Today, Jen will be sharing with us some helpful tips on how families can prepare for distance learning at home. Thanks, Holly. Like many of you, I am also preparing for my children to start the year in distance learning. I'm here with you today to share some resources and tips for how to set your student up for success at the beginning of the school year. Tip number one, find a space. Set up a dedicated space for learning. This might be organizing materials into one place, finding a specific spot to sit in each day, maybe a table or a desk in a quiet area. Tip number two, get organized. Organize the materials from your school. This might include workbooks, textbooks, or any additional supplies. Tip number three, get connected. Make sure your student has a device. Please reach out to your school's principal if your student needs a device or support with internet access. Tip number four, read. Read with your student for 20 minutes every day. Or have your student read to you. They can even read on their own. Check out our library website for access to free reading resources, including audiobooks, ebooks, read alouds. We even have graphic novels. Tip number five, move. Make time to be offline. This might be taking a break to go for a walk, cooking dinner as a family, or having a dance party break in the living room. We hope you will check out the additional resources at the end of this video. Thank you so much, and I'm wishing you a great start to the 2020-21 school year. Thank you so much, Jen, for joining us today and sharing those useful tips. The resources that Jen shared with us today can be found here. You can find additional resources, important announcements, and up-to-date information on the district website at www.fsusd.org. You can also follow us on Facebook, Instagram, or Twitter. Be sure and check back next week for more resources and tips for families. If there's something that you would like to know more about, let me know. You can email me at engage at fsusd.org. Thank you for joining us today, and we'll see you next Friday.